Nope, it wasn't photoshopped. Martha Stewart just became the oldest Sports Illustrated swimsuit model ever at 81 years old. What a dude was arrested doing at Gaga's house and Britney Spears has paid her lawyer, one lawyer in particular, $4 million, but that's just a fraction of what she's paid in lawyers. That's coming up with what's trending. I swear I thought it was photoshopped yesterday when I first saw it, but no, this is legit. Martha Stewart just became the oldest Sports Illustrated swimsuit model ever. She's 81 years old. The internet and Instagram models have kind of made the annual edition less relevant, so they got to do something to get people talking. So they stuck Martha Stewart on the cover, and it's definitely got people talking. And all I'm saying is she looks really good. That's why I thought it was photoshopped at first. Well, giving Lady Gaga flowers can be very dangerous. Just ask the dude that just tried to give her flowers. Cops rushed to Gaga's house after her security called, and they were saying that there's some dude on her property. Security detained him. Once the cops got there, he told the cops he was just dropping off flowers to her. And he only got to the base of her driveway before he was stopped. But what's really scary is this dude has been on her property multiple times and he always drops off little gifts for her. And he wasn't arrested because of the flowers, but she was home, which is even scarier. But she had no contact with him. Dude needs to stay away. And what is it with security guards not getting to these celebrities in time? Like you think that they would have better security systems, but it happens all the time. Well, Britney Spears has paid her lawyer, one particular, Matthew Rosengart, over $4 million in legal fees, mostly for work that he did after her conservatorship ended. But she has paid him so much in legal fees that he's willing to do pro bono as he finishes up her case. Now, all that was paid just from November of 2021 to March of 2023. Now, there have actually been dozens of lawyers that she's had to deal with since the conservatorship began, the 13-year-long one, and it's actually been about $30 million that she's paid in total for lawyers. And she was worth $60 million when the conservatorship ended. So she's worth a lot less than that now. But her husband has had it. He is speaking out, especially about what we talked about yesterday, that TMZ documentary about her marriage being on the rocks with Sam and her mental health. And he is just calling total BS. It's all clickbait. The last thing I want to do is, is speak on my wife's behalf. I would never do that. I respect her privacy. That's why I don't talk as much. And I found it absolutely disgusting for the people that were in her life at the time. When she didn't have a voice, they went and told her story like it was theirs. It was absolutely disgusting. And how are you going to take the most influential person of our generation, the princess of pop, America's sweetheart, and put her in prison? where her father tells her what to do, what water to drink, who to see, and use her as a money-making machine. And then all of a sudden, after 15 years, when she's free after all those gaslighting and after all those, those things that went down, now you're going to put her under a mic microscope and tell her story? No. Don't forget to click below and subscribe, and I'll talk to you tomorrow.